Beds in danger of closing. A flyer warning that 100 shelter beds at the River District Navigation Center could close are now circulating in the Northwest Portland neighborhood. The shelter, open since 2019, needs immediate action to be taken. Brandon Thompson digging deeper into the situation and learning about those efforts to keep it open. Brandon? Well, the owner of the facility, Harbor of Hope, says they do not plan to close the facility. Rather, they do plan to hand it over to the city because they say they cannot handle the on-site management anymore. When the River District Navigation Center opened four years ago... Make sure that they have everything they need to be able to navigate the system. It was a unique model to address the city's growing homeless crisis. When we first did this, they were very accepting of it. We had buy-in from the neighborhood. But since, neighbors have been frustrated, pushing back since last year against expanding the shelter to include a safe rest site because of the issues they've seen. Accumulations of trash, criminal activity, building up of, t of tents. It wasn't fair to the neighborhood, wasn't fair to us, and uh, it wasn't what we bargained for. It's why Harbor of Hope wants out, offering to donate the facility the organization raised $4 million to build to the city so they can oversee it. The problems Harbor of Hope has stems from the shelter operator transition projects. The two organizations disagree on which is responsible for preventing the issues seen outside of the facility. William says monthly and even quarterly progress reports were hard to get to track the progress of people in the shelter. We had a responsibility to the people who made the investment here to let them know what was going on. In a statement, Transition Project says its, quote, responsibility is to the 90 individuals and couples living in the River District Navigation Center and helping them on their journey to permanent housing. We're proud of our progress, including seeing more than 20 people from the center move into apartments across the metro area in the past few months. If the city does the job that they say they're going to do, we're going to you know, find a more receptive position from other neighborhoods. But they've got to see it working. So there's a public hearing on this tomorrow night in the Portland building at 6 p.m. Now, the contract for transition projects to operate this facility goes through the spring. The organization and the city tell me there are no plans to change the contract at this time. Live in Northwest Portland, Brandon Thompson, Coin 6 News.